Body kick. Oh! oh! Big right from Oliveira. Hammer fist. Nick Lentz is down. Wow. Charles Duprox Oliveira doesn't wrap him up. He knocks him out. Now listen, this is something he'd been doing the whole fight. He was catching the kicks of Nick's, Nick Lentz and landing that beautiful straight right hand down the middle. Just this time, it was right on the button. Puts him down, icing on the cake. Charles Dubronx Oliveira continues the win streak. Elkins grabs a hold of him. He's got him up. And down. And a big takedown. But immediately, look how he scrambles to guard. And look at this. Spectacular jiu-jitsu He's got a triangle. Practitioner. He's got it locked up, Mike. Right Going away. On the back of the head, Joe. Oliveira turning it into an arm bar. He's got a triangle and an arm bar combination. Elkins, Elkins is, is in, in all trouble. kinds of trouble. Wow. The hype is for real. Man. That kid locked up that triangle so fast. So beautiful. Look how good his technique is. Elkins gets a hold of him. Dumps him, but immediately, look how Oliveira scrambled right to guard. And then he's in this position, he's got that right arm tied up, slaps that leg over the left, slaps it back on. Look at that, look at that triangle. Woo. Adjusts it, pulls his foot down. He's turning him, he's got the arm and the triangle together, wrapped up, he controls the legs. He always gets that left underhook on the leg. This is beautiful technique here. I mean, he's just doing everything perfect. Outstanding technique by this young Charles Oliveira. He is all over Jim Miller, throwing the tips on both sides. Oh, he's in trouble. It's over. Oh, that's tight. It's over. It's over. Wins from Jim Miller trying to fight off this choke. Trying. Uh, is it behind the head yet? Oh, yeah, it's over. There's the tap. Wow. Charles Oliveira oh. does it again. Wow. Wow. Unbelievable. You see Jim Miller goes for that big inside leg kick. He gets double underhooks. Now, Jim Miller was doing a good job of preventing that slam by having that inside hook. Charles Oliveira was patient, held him up, cleared the hook, and slammed him down. Immediately threw both hooks in, took his back, sunk in this choke. This was about his second or third attempt at this rear naked choke. And once he had it, man, his squeeze is relentless. You see Jim Miller's face getting red, forced to tap. Impressive submission of victory by Charles Oliveira. Trying to work him around. Oh, he dropped down for a heel hook. Looking to finish it quick by he's submission. Got it. He's got it. Can he get it right here? Oh, man. He slipped right out of it. Very nicely done by Wisey. He turned over exactly the right way. But his foot is still trapped in there. He can turn it into a knee bar, but not now. The knee is a little bit further down on the crotch. He's out of it. But he's got to be careful here because Oliveira is going to take his back. Oh, wow. He had his leg locked in a terrible position there. And he's forced to tap just from taking his back. Oliveira took advantage of the fact that he lost the leg lock, but still had the leg tied up. See, he's going for the knee bar. Wisely did a really good job of countering, left his leg bent there, but look what Oliveira does. He, he puts tremendous pressure on the calf and the knee, pulled him into him, used the leverage of holding the foot in place. There, look, he's got the legs triangled. Look at the pressure on the knee of Wisely, and you see the, the strain in his face and wisely force the tap, a brilliant move by Oliveira. Oh, nice knee. Oh, he clipped him with that right hand. There's that guillotine, and Oliveira's guillotine is nasty. It's what he's great at. It is so nasty. This is terrible. That's There's it. the tap. Charles Oliveira by submission. That's got a familiar tone to it. He's so good off of his back, and he's so good at cinching up submissions. His the game is so technical when it comes to his jiu-jitsu. Look at this guard pull. This is confidence. Those long legs, 100% commitment with the hips. Clay Guida held out as long as he could, but once you're in there, that is it. We knew he had skills. They were on display tonight. Pioki's out of position. Excellent escape from Oliveira. A battle of black belts. Oliveira looking for that Darce again and again. Now sitting to guard. Trying to lock it up here. Kind of a modified Peruvian choke here, and he's got it. Charles Oliveira, the first to submit, Hatsu Hioki. What a beautiful submission from Charles Oliveira.
gets a grappling whiz in Hatsu Hiyoki, but it's Oliveira who wins that battle. He went from almost getting submitted with a choke to locking in this choke, and he sat right into it. Throws that leg up and over the shoulder, and that is so tight. A huge victory for Charles Oliveira. And a forearm He's shiver there from Oli Vera. This is it. Who's He's letting it go on him? The, the... Charles wow. Oli Vera trying to end the fight. Tamer with and the Hail is. Mary, but Here's look out. Trying for another submission. And there is the tap. He continues to pile onto his record. Charles Dubrox, Oli Vera. Absolutely incredible. Hurt him on the feet, swarmed on him with the punches, and then got the choke. That is how it's done. Tamer doesn't know what's going on. Oliveira's having a field day. And then once you're rocked, once you're wobbled like this, you've got no, no sense of really what's going on. So it's no surprise that he got the submission, but incredible performance.